What's up guys, my name is Eric AKA as really turn on and today we're playing some demolition on Summit. Um, this is not a high KDR game, this is not a thrills and chills and spills and frills. Chills? That game? Uh, this is teamwork, teamwork at its core. Uh, where my team is working together to defend our objectives and not take no sass from nobody. Uh, like I said, it's a teamwork teamwork game. Uh, I only go 10 and 2, but my team works together really well to get a shutout uh, on defense. They do not plant at all. Uh, and then also getting a uh, sh absolutely just dominating game. Uh, for the second round when we're on the assaulting team. Um, because what happens is we both bombs uh, go off, off of, from their first plant. So it's a very f fast second half. Uh, anyways, so what I want to talk to you guys about is uh, what do you guys think about the new DLC map pack that is coming out tomorrow? Um... There are five new maps included for 1,200 Microsoft points. Uh, $15 for those of us that use real currency. Uh, 1,200 Microsoft points, five maps, uh, four multiplayer, and one zombies. Um, the four maps are Berlin Wall, uh, some Antarctic one. Uh, Ascension is the zombies map. Uh, there's a bullshit death. Um, I can't remember what the... Oh, Kowloon. Uh, and then there's one other one, and I can't remember what it's called. Um, but there's four maps for multiplayer. Um, not really looking forward to a lot of them. I'm looking forward to something different. I'm looking forward to not playing Nuketown every five seconds. Uh, because that's what it seems to be. Everybody has their favorite maps, and Nuketown is generally it. Um, but... Looking forward to playing different maps. Um, looking forward primarily to Berlin, Berlin Wall, um, as it's being touted as a sniper map. Um, so hopefully that job, works out well. Um, I'm not looking forward to the Kowloon, even though it has like the new zip line feature oh, thing yeah. where you can zip across the map. Um, that to me just has no appeal um, because Cobra, mostly. Nobody's really going to be using it, and anybody that does use it is going to get shot really fast. Not to mention the fact that they didn't make the animation for it very interesting. Um, like, it looks cool in the first person, but watching somebody do it, nah. It, it's just somebody hanging there. It's not like they're swinging around or anything. Can't do anything while you're... And you can't even drop off early if I'm... If it's a, what I expect it is. We can't even drop off of it. Um, so, yeah, I'm not. And the other map, I'm not sure. I don't remember which one it was. Um, what the fourth map is, but no, it, when I watched the trailer, it didn't really strike me as all that interesting. Uh, incoming bullshit death, also from the napalm strike. I pretty much called it in right on myself, so that was my own fault. But I still hated it. Anyways, uh, game's about to end. Let me know what you think in the comments about the new maps and how you generally interact with teams when you play uh, specific, you know, objective-based games. How do you work with your team? Or are they generally just a bunch of useless faggots? Uh, let me know in the comments. Uh, Metal Storm, I fucked your mom. And that's going to do it. Take care, guys, and hope you enjoyed. Bye.